Okay, time to take a look at Ymir Valley. <clears throat> Alright, the surge is on. The Magic Knight's somewhere in this direction, right? That's right. It's very slowly coming this way. As long as we keep following this path, we should find ourselves face to face with it at some point. Well, the farther away it is, the better. We're gonna need to finish it off before it reaches the town, or we're in trouble. You two have been up here a few fair times, right? Fair few times? Yeah, I went this, uh, up this way with the rest of Class 7 just a couple months ago, even, during a drama CD that was not playable. I wasn't really planning to, but we didn't have much of a choice thanks to Blue Blonde and his antics. Blue Blonde, huh? Yeah, sounds like his thing. Once he's lashed onto you, it's a one-way trip to Crazy Town. It sounds like it's a little late to be saying that to you. I don't get the feeling he's involved in any of this, though. <clears throat> the weather is much milder now than it was then, so we shouldn't have quite as much trouble climbing, thankfully. That doesn't mean it won't be dangerous, however. Watch your step. Ugh. If I'm gonna take a wild guess, this thing is going to be. I maybe I should try total against it. Um, what the? It's an event. Oops! Looks like we found ourselves a monster and a fairly tough-looking one too. Indeed, though I can't imagine it being a problem as long as we make proper use of our combat links. Be careful, Elise. I will. Now use combat links. Use assist and. Playing battles and viewing buying events will increase Link EXP. When enough has been earned, the character's Link will increase, blah blah blah. Yeah, I should probably do that before I actually get into the battle itself. But who should I link up here? We only have Link. Yeah, I guess he starts out with a higher Link level with his own sister. That would make sense. She gets auto tier. Who knows what Tobo gets? Now's our chance. Ah, uh, did not time that right. Oh well, I can. I'll probably be able to squeeze a victory anyways. I did not realize Tobol would just swing it normally if he's too close. Shoot. It's really confusing when they have two different field attacks. Alright. Let's see what I can unbalance them with. Cryon should be unbalanced by Blunt. Got it. Let's move. This one has a high unbalanced chance anyway, so... All right. Second form. Oh, I meant to unbalance one. Now. Now. I'm up. Cannot unbalance this. Hmm. Okay, show us what you can do. This is a magic type attack. That means it's not going to receive much benefit from Reen's Motivate. Now. Okay, do your worst. I'm up! Oh no, it's casting. Do you have an impede on you? No. Let's move. Fortunately, Reen does. There. Ha. Ha. Should Please be. tell me you can impede.
double strike. One, two. Well, not that matters. It's dying one hit there. That's it for you. All right. But at least we've gotten a, a closer to. Uh, I probably should have leveled up from that. Oh well. Well done, Elise. Hey, thank you, Reen. Cool, now that we've covered the basics, let's get back to searching. Well, combat links. I heard it goes beyond level 5 this time. There's no disadvantage either, so, yeah, I'd always be prepared to link. Weapon types and unbalancing. Most monsters are more easily unbalanced by Reen's slash, crustaceans by Elise's thrust. Our types include Pierce, strong versus flying enemies, and Strike, strong versus rock enemies, or hard shelled enemies. Damage type varies by character. Critical damage. Attacks with a critical bonus have a 100% chance of unbalancing, regardless of the damage type dealt. Total's unique accessory quick caliber allows them to use arts more quickly than other characters. Yeah, he is the main arts user here. You all right, Elise? Let's move. Oh, don't worry. I'm fine. Just warms your heart, doesn't ha! it? Ha! Ha! Sit! You'll say so. I can do this. Yeah! Duh! Yeah! Duh! Sure thing. <laughs> huh. Doesn't consume any EP to use this, fortunately. Alright, there should be a chest here. I probably won't go all the way to the boss. I might go back to the farm stuff later. Oh, okay, a flying rat. My turn. Right. Uh, do we have Pierce? Okay, Tobol, you you're up. Oh, the advantage is ours. The advantage is ours. Ready to go. <clears throat> Hmm. Try this. Spear break. Fire. Wh well, how exactly does this one work? Whoa. Let's move. Every everything really does have really high evasion in this game. I need to get the hit course as soon as I can. Urgh. Second form. Yeah. Second form. Now. I'll back you up. Please allow me. It's also magic. This is it. Got you. Here I go. Okay, we can. I'll just wait and have you scan this one. <laughs> What's so interesting about you? Substitution the flying feline. Looks cute, but it's deadly. I can do this. Strangely, it's resistant to earth rather than ice. My turn. Ha! That's that. Let's keep moving. All right. Oh, chest. I wonder what's inside. Lighter prevents freezing. <laughs> Relax. Here I go. Ready to go. Uh, My turn. This one is obviously a slash weakness. Now's our chance. I'm up. All right. <clears throat> Analyze. Just activate. Here I go. AT delay. I can do this. There. This is it. This is it. Got you. <laughs> there you go. Okay, I'm scouted. Up. My turn. Ah, she doesn't have much movement. 
my turn. Ha! I can do this. Yeah. Uh. Sure thing. Well, that's that. Okay. So how bad is there? Seven movement. That's it, huh? Uh, range for attack is all all really short on everyone. All right, be right back. I'm gonna kill this cry on bit. Okay, I just noticed. I just noticed this recently, but Reen's ATS might actually be higher than it was back in his end game levels in the first game. I think they might have rebalanced this so that magic based crafts are to do better damage. That could be it. I'm not sure. Is there something back there? Maybe it... No. Alright, another one of those rat things. Be right back. I mean, flying cats, yeah. We should cross the bridge we just passed. Let's move! A uh, monster chest. We may have to use our S crafts here. Oh, chest. I wonder what's inside. Be right back. Let's get... All right, I'm gonna have Tobol use his S craft right. Let's get started. just because it can hit more people. All right. <coughs> I can do this. There. Now. now. Got you. Sure thing. Art analyze. Uh oh. Here you go. Okay, let's use Rebellion Storm. Time to stop holding back. Oh boy. <clears throat> Why couldn't you have done this in the Carnelia books? This is gonna hurt. Maybe you learned it afterwards from uh, or something. Bike, just like in volleyball. That's Pieces that. of eight achievement obtained. All right. The least levels up. <laughs> Every little improvement counts. And all we got was zero powder. Uh, only they made this an action RPG. Oh, they do actually mark monster chests differently. Okay, you material in that chest. Let's. What's that? I can do this. Ready to go. Hmm. I'm scared. Why can't I hit this thing? Yes, I got it. The advantage is ours. I'm up. Snow wisp. Just activate. I'm guessing it's really high evasion. All right. Wait. There. Or not. Okay, so what's seriously what's so special about this anyways? Sure thing. Seriously. Oh no, it does have high evasion. Here I go. Ah, uh, in other words, I better use long range attacks to not get hit. Ah! Uh, I have to kill of arts after all. Yeah. yeah. It dodged really easily. <laughs> Shall we move on? I'm gonna need all the accuracy I can get in this game. <laughs> Once they start letting me make courts again. My turn.
Whoa, wrong way. What's anything new he up here? Nope, just a crying bit. Be right back. Yeah, seriously, uh, accuracy is really bad in this game for some reason. Even for the early part of the game. The wind seems to be picking up. We should hurry before the sun begins to set. Ah. Uh. Uh. Turl bomb. Uh, when these evasive things again. Uh. Now's our chance. Let's get him. All right, there should be a poison quartz somewhere. Whoa! Why are you stopping here? Whoa, we're finally at the halfway point. How are you feeling, Elise? We're very well, thank you. There's no need to worry. You've been through so much, Reen, especially in recent months, and yet you've managed to overcome it all. Climbing a mountain as small as this can hardly hope to compare. Well, if you insist, but if you need to take a break, there's no shame in saying so. Agreed. The monsters around here are on the tough side. Sure, we can last as long as we pace ourselves. Just keep backing your brother up. I'm here backing both of you up, too. Thank you. We're getting closer to that magic knight. I can sense it. But just so we're perfectly clear, you do know you don't stand a chance against it with just the three of you, do you? Don't you? Sure do, kitten. It wouldn't be my first time going up against something that huge, but size isn't the only issue here. How do I put this? It's like there was some kind of strange power inside of it that was helping it move. Does that mean we'll have to find a way to deal with that first? I think I know just a way to do it. Selene, can we go back to Velmar? I'd like to ask for his help. If you feel that's the best option we have, then I have no got nothing more to say. Just be sure you're mentally prepared by the time we get there. I'm prepared. Hmm? Got some kind of plan in mind? Works for me, we don't have much farther to go, and any plan at this point is better than none. Let's move, and remember, slow and stays away. That thing is about Valimar's size, so it would be a fair fight, I suppose. Let's move! Ah, rock monster. Please, allow Ready me! Ready to go! Oh, Chaz, the one what's inside. Ah! It's traveling pretty far up. Get, gotcha! Now's our chance, let's get him! Alright. What a splendid chest! Webbing bomb. Poison. Poison chance, alright. There's one more enemy blocking my way. Ah! It sounded close. That kind of scared Let's me. Get yourselves ready. Chance. All right, let's open it up. Lots of sepith, but I haven't seen a single, uh, a, a single place to synthesize them yet. <laughs> yeah, I might want to head back to town, and stock up some more first, as well as grind a bit on Elise. She is kind of weak. You can enter the foot bath by pressing the A button. While relaxing. Uh, hit, uh, hit point EP and CP will slowly recover over time. Oh, there's a foot bath. Thinking about warming yourself up a bit before you leave? I don't see why we shouldn't. Let's do it. Yeah, this is gonna be good if you wanted to start. Uh, if you wanted to s start up against a boss battle with really high uh, 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 CP, it refills fairly quickly too. Reen's already t t uh, topped out. Nice. Yes, yeah, so now I can start the boss ball strong. Okay, let's give this next boss a shot. I put I put everyone except for Reen in the back row. Reen is going to focus on tanking while Elise heals him and Tobol uses arts. That's a pretty basic strategy. Oh? 
Well, this is it. Some kind of ruins? This is a monument that caused all the trouble you you brought up before, right? Even now I can sense some spiritual power. And as far as I can tell, everything here is in order. Yeah, I don't see anything abnormal going on either. It caused me a lot of trouble back when I was a kid too. So that was that bear uh, was that bear related to the monument in some way? I guess I'm cursed by this spot, aren't I? Reen, don't be silly. As soon as you say that, <laughs> the magic knight shows up anyways. Here it comes. Magic Knight Ortheim. It seems I've been dead against Awakeners. Or maybe it's being controlled by someone. Who knows? How could it perfectly how could it be perfectly fine after falling off a damn cliff? Ancient legends mentioned they had the power to regenerate, but I didn't think it held that much merit. They always hold merit. We have to stop it from reaching your mirror. Don't do anything that will put yourself in unnecessary danger, Elise. I won't. Right, let's give her a best shot. Ah. Stay sharp, guys. Ah. This is not a very fun boss. It has a healing ability that makes it kind of cheap. Alright. Art. Chrono Drive on these two. Let's move. Boom. Wait. Metal scope. Ow. I'm up. Disactivate. Please. Uh, this was a really fresh. This is a really frustrating boss. It has a buff and a. It has an attack that buffs buffs and heals. So it's really. Really cheap. It's kind of just it's pretty, basically Kurt 2.0. Thanks. Uh. Let's move. Basically, once I get low enough, I need to find an opportunity to. Waste it with everyone's S crafts. Real, and they did. Worst of all, they didn't even bother letting me make new uh, courts, so I can't stick another tier on to say Tobol and make it easier to heal. This game is really, tr really trying to uh, uh, screw you over with this first boss on Nightmare. That's for sure. Uh, take this, Spark Arrow. Try to avoid having these two use their CP if possible. I want to. I just want to have everyone just uh, kill it with one big blaze of glory, if possible. <sighs> ah! This will hit everyone. Ouch! Ready to go. Boom. Here I go. Uh, sadly, Elise has crap strength, so she won't be able to deal much damage, if any. Uh. Boom. I'm up. Wait, did it get poisoned? Oh, that's pretty lucky. I didn't even think a magic knight would be poisonable at all. Yeah, so that's a, uh, these bosses are way too resistant. I can't do anything to them. Wouldn't it be nice if I could g get this thing sealed and prevent it from moving entirely? That would be so great, but it, it's only like a 2% chance if I combine both percentages. Activate. 
Here it go. All right. Boom. Hit me with your best shot. No! Dude, how could you? They're healing so early in the fight. And that poison did, like, nothing to it. Ah, This is so discouraging and cheap. There needs to be a limit to how much I can do this. But no, this game does not... Uh, uh, this game... Just doesn't give a shit. Ugh. Okay, activate. I'm up. Corona Drive. Thanks. Uh. I'm up. Just activate. I'm gonna have to Here use some of the DLC items for this, probably. Ugh. Come on, Ortheim, take some damage for once. Oh no! My turn. Ha! Ready to go. Uh. Please seal it, seal it, please. Even if it's a two percent chance, I need it to seal. Let's move. Ha! Oh. Oh no! Oh god! Cheers. Yeah, I have no choice of holy squall here. Shoot. I'm up. Yeah, this boss knows no balance at all. My turn. All right. Ready to go. Spark arrow. Uh. Holy squall. Ow. Ready to go. Yeah, screw it. EP charge four. I still have plenty of DLC left anyways. My turn. Ah. I need to think of a- I need to find the best timing to, uh, Ready use- to Seriously, the lower it's hit points, the more it spams that damn buff move. It's really annoying. Even with double speed, I feel like I'm not- it's, it's really hard to outspeed the boss. Thanks! Uh. I'm up. I don't know if Spark Arrow is even worth using right now. It's just too expensive. Here you go. Boom. I really hate how they reduce the duration of yeah. Motivate as well. Thanks. It's like they're... They must have planned this a, 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 ahead of time, seriously. Ah. Right. Uh, infuriating. Ready to go. Activate. 
Yeah, so I just need pure Blitz. speed. Why does getting hit by such a powerful attack only give him 5 CP? What a ripoff. Huh. Uh. My turn. Uh. Come on. Please allow me. More. Thanks. Sure thing. Oh man, if, I, if this could be a good opportunity to spam mess crafts. Set him on fire too. Uh. Wait. Okay, I just need to use as many arts as I can in an effort to beat this thing down. Yeah. Can you squeeze in one more art? Yeah, so let's squeak in a, a spark arrow. Yes. Let's finish you. Time to stop holding back. Yeah, stop holding back. I got you. I got you now, you damn he overhealing bastard. Ha ha! -ya. You uh, are. Hurt. I see no future in which you will live. Rebellion. Storm. Ugh! Rebellion. Viva la revolution! Hey, I didn't even need to use the Lisa's S craft. Sorry. Shoot, That's I never got this. I lost my chance to show it off. Oh well, I'll take this narrow victory. Yes, yeah, so this thing is basically Kurt 2.0. You gotta be able to smash it with all your S crafts at the end. Pant, pant. Think that's it? Not yet. It's powering up even further. What? Where'd you grow with those new arms from? Where are you even hiding those swords? How can I grow more arms? You can't be serious. Well, I think he's ready. Ready enough, but he won't be able to fight for very long. Still, he's not the best chance we got. At least, Toll, stay back. Why? What for? Heed my call. Yes, Valamar. Time to stop resting. Seriously, did how hard did Crow hit you? He must have hit you like he must have sliced your robotic dick off or something. And then you spent like a whole month re repairing it. Yeah, actually, he really does have a robotic dick. He has a little thing hanging down from his genitals. I guess that part got way too damaged during that fight with Ordine. Yes, and then that ended up transferring to Reen. The paint transferred to Reen's stick, and that's why he had to recover for a whole month. It explains everything. I see. It. Yes, castration is one way to level down the character, apparently. Well, that's my fan theory. I'm not sure. If, I'm not sure if it's. I'm probably not really Kanan. Okay, we got past the boss's cheap healing phase, so now we get to we get to be it down with Valimar himself. Yes. Yeah, he 
He's recovered enough to fend off this guy, at least. <laughs> Try and actually win this time, got it? Not a problem. I'm counting on you, Valimar. Our target's the Magic Knight right in front of us. Wait, really? That's only five minutes. Is this actually a, is there a real time limit in this battle? Or a certain number of turns I get to u move? Oh, shoot. So this is the Ashen Knight? I'd heard about it fighting against the Alliance forces trying to take over Tristan. Wow, this is something else. Are you really moving that, Reed? Elise, Tomba, I'll take care of this. Stay back. <laughs> Roger that. Come on, Missy. We're gonna be in danger if we stay here. All right. Uh, let's hope it doesn't heal too much during this part of the boss battle. I'll have to rely on the unarmed form this time too. But that's fine by me. That means I don't get to use all the uh, uh, crafts that uh, uh, that he got as a sword uh, uh, in sword mode. Okay, here goes. Uh, you know, it's really weird. A lot of the crafts that Reen uses right. as, as Valimar don't seem to be the same as the ones he uses as a human. Even even Morning Moon, which Richard could use as a human, probably. What about Divine Knight Battles? Three areas to be targeted. Head, body, arms. Each part has a separate unbalanced efficiency value, with more stars indicating a higher chance to unbalance the enemy. Unbalancing allows you to execute a follow-up attack which grants you one bravery. Free Braveries allows you to use a powerful rush attack, which is basically like the the Mecha's S craft. Which of the free areas is the enemy's weak point varies depending on his stance. We only have Morning Moon this time. Seriously, how much did he weaken you? Anyways, at this point, it's weak to the it's head. It's the weakness. Let's go. Let's go. Aha! Ow! Still its head. View specifics. Regain its true form, wields a giant sword in each hand to cleave foes easily. Here it goes. Now! <clears throat> this is revenge for all your cheap skills in the last fight. Okay, now I have to attack its arms. Let's go. Let's go. It's working. Keep it up. Arr. This could be bad. Ugh, this is bad. But I should be able to use my S craft on it soon. Let's go! What the? There was no del- I got to move again? Sweet! Um, let's see, its head is still the weak point. Now! Ow. I can still hold on for a little bit longer. Bring it on! Bring it on! Oh yeah! Now! I did not even need to heal that time! Haha! -ha. Yes, that morning moon counter was brilliant too. Last time Crow was able to hit me even though I was in that stance, but this time I managed to dodge and counter the enemy. Yes. I 
think he's used up every last bit of the mana he recovered. Seriously, Valimar, uh, how do we get you more mana easily? Do we have to just upgrade Reen's Orbman or something? <sighs> that was a close one. You didn't have a weapon, and yet you still came out on top, Reen. Not half bad. Not that it means you're ready to take on the Azure Awakener. That's a ways away. Yeah. I'll bet. Combat efficiency demonstrated a 5% increase over the previous battle. That makes no sense. Isn't Reen a lot weaker than before? Plus, Velomar's stats were actually lower in this fight than in, than in a Cold Steel 1. I look forward to observing further improvement in the future. Seriously, what if the enemy just keeps going for our growing attacks just to keep us under leveled forever? Maybe that's why Estelle and Joshua are probably never going to catch up to Ouroboros fighters in terms of combat power. Ah. Uh. <laughs> sure. I hope I don't let you down. I barely know a thing about you. But even then, it's clear as day that you're far more reliable than I'll ever be. Hmm. Well, it doesn't matter how it happened. Fact is, we're now fighting alongside one another as both allies and friends. So don't worry. Uh. I'll do everything I can to become strong enough to draw out your full power. Strong enough to even win against Krull. Hmm. I shall wait that day. <sighs> Being Crow, huh? Reen! Hey there. You did great, champ. Thanks. You didn't get hurt at all, did you, Elise? Uh, I'm fine. I'm more concerned about you. Are you feeling all right? I'd heard about what happened the last time you fought inside that thing. <laughs> I'm a little tired, but that's all. I probably wouldn't have gotten off so easily if things were anywhere close to being like last time, honestly. As I've said once before, all damage taken by a Divine Knight is passed on to its Awakener. So take that as extra motivation to continue getting better at piloting him. Oh yeah, you did say that, didn't you? Well, I'd have to improve my piloting skills to get things done anyway. I've got every intention of getting better. <laughs> You're sounding a lot more sure of yourself now. Does that mean you're feeling better? Yeah, never better. If I want to reunite with the others, I need to uh, keep moving forward. Maybe I should splice in a clip of Elise using her own S craft uh, on, uh, uh, on a separate video uh, 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 or something. Uh, well, on a different save file just to at least give this video a sense of completion. Sorry. I've got a feeling I'm just yeah. going to be causing you a lot more grief in the future. Oh, don't you worry about that. I'm plenty used to it. And besides, I'd like nothing more than for you to be reunited with your classmates. Thanks, Elise. Oh, you can be such a troublemaker. <laughs> Sounds like things are all wrapped up here. <laughs> I wouldn't be so sure about that. Oh, come on. She was the one who sent that knight after us, wasn't she? That can't be. Oh, not now. Uh, probably did so that we can't use at Valimar to f in case th there's an attack on somewhere else. I guess. Rianos! It's the bird I saw in the capital. Hello there, darling. Miss me? It's so lovely to see you again, Reen. Feelings not Is that mutual. Bird talking. After Celine, a bird shouldn't be any more surprising. But still, you've got some nerve showing yourself, Vita. Although not enough nerve to show up in person, apparently. So what does Ouroboros' oh-so-amazing second Anguis, the Azure Abyss herself, want with us? What's an Anguis? One of Ouroboros' top brass. They're all totally OP. How does she know we were up here? Is it because... <laughs> it's nice to see you again, uh, too, Celine. 
Celine can keep track of her contractors. Don't tell me she can keep track of Celine somehow. And while I know of them, I can't say I recall ever being formally introduced to Reen's adorable oh, no. sister or that handsome Maybe, she's, racer maybe she knows that uh, Alfin is in the area and she's uh, sending some goons to kidnap her for the Alliance. I'm sorry that our first meeting had to be through my familiar. Huh? Misty. No. I suppose I should call you Vita now. How did you know we were here? We've been trying to find the whereabouts of the Ashen Knight for quite a while, you see. We've been searching for the past month since the Civil War began without any luck. But then we sensed an active magic knight in this area, and that oh. was what finally led us to so you. So that magic knight was acting on its own originally? Uh, I wasn't expecting our location to be discovered this quickly. <laughs> I got to see your battle with Crow too, incidentally. For it being the first time you've ever piloted a knight, you did rather well. Um, thanks I guess? If we're being objective though, it was more akin to a tiger swatting away at a cub. <sighs> What are Crow and that Azure Knight doing now, anyway? And what happened to everyone at the Academy? I'm sure they're fine, Reen. <laughs> Crow's been keeping himself very, very busy. The Noble Alliance forces see him as their little Joker. They call him the Azure Chevalier now. <gasps> I'm afraid I don't know anything about your classmates, though. Emma's in hiding now, too. Still. If you want to know that badly... Huh? Why she looks surprised? Isn't she behind uh, that, didn't uh, that sound too? Good. That sounded like... That sounded like gunfire! Uh-oh. I wasn't expecting them to arrive so soon. It sounds like the Jaegers hired by Duke Alborea are here. They're here- they're after Alfin. I'm guessing it's only a matter of time now before Princess Alfin is taken into their custody. Jaegers! In your mirror? Her Highness? Damn it. I can assure you that I have nothing to do with what's happening over there. But you're an angry you You guys are always in control, aren't you? <laughs> I think you're going to want to hurry, though. Perhaps if you run fast enough, you might be able to get back in time. Uh, are you sure this wasn't coordinated? That magic knight seemed, t knight's timing seemed a little too good, don't you think? How dare she act like this is all some game! Let it go, Selina! We've gotta hurry! Yeah, Her Highness and the rest of you near are in real danger if we don't get moving. Right! Do I have to walk back? Or do I automatically walk? Oh. I'm all disoriented. So sorry, Valmar. We'll be coming back for you soon. We need to hurry down the valley. <sighs> Where the heck does this go? The canyon. Well, maybe I'll get my chance to show off her S craft here. Strangely, Tobo and Rinori have their CP filled to a hundred. Two versions: the normal version, the Divine Night Battle version. Seriously, that uh, that healing pet was so cheap, and it's a lot faster than. Before too, 58 speed. It's even faster than Reen now. Last time Reen was matched with in speed. Now, nope. Ah. Uh. Uh. All right, I'll make my way back. Maybe find a chance to to get at least to use her S craft. Okay, let's see what your S craft looks like. Fragrant Garden. That somehow did sure not thing. 
deal as much damage as I hope. Huh. That was anticlimactic. Sorry, that's it for you. Fragrant Garden. Oh sh I probably would have done more damage. If I had buffed her first. Oh well. I wonder which Jaeger core we're dealing with here. I really hope everyone's all right. Well, no, they're gonna Let's have conversations as they go down this mountain. Shoot. I wish there were more free slots. Uh, uh, there more free buttons on my. Uh, 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 uh. No, that would be a bad idea. If I actually put, put, if I put my recording button on there and, and uh, accidentally press the wrong button, gameplay that would be bad too. Shoot. Yeah, I can't just put a recording hotkey on there. Uh. Oh no. Pant pant. Elise, are you okay? Uh, I can't believe they sent Jaeger to Ymir. Looks like the Noble Alliance doesn't even care ab about trying to keep up appearances anymore. The angry says she had nothing to do with it, though. It's true that this kind of thing isn't really her style. If she were to dub someone, trust me, she'd, be, she'd happily enjoy squeezing a life out of such a nasty spectacle to the very last drop. So it's just going to show that the Noble Alliance isn't quite as united as it looks. Guess not as good as time any to ask. Just who is Missy? I mean, via Clotilde, anyways. You know, Missy is the radio show host, and Clotilde, the opera singer, were both just acts. She's a member of the Hexen Clan, too. She's known as the Witch of the Abyss, and she vanished after breaking a taboo seven years ago. What's this taboo? Think of her as a, like a sister of Emma. And that blue bird who's usually with her, Rianos, is a familiar like me. A witch? A familiar? Well, I'm lost. In short, she's related to you and Emma, right? Essentially, yes. Emma's been trying to find Vita ever since she disappeared. She had to put on, on hold when her duty required her to join the Academy. How could we have missed her when she was so close by th that whole time? Wait a second. Missy spent a fair amount of time in Trista, going to and from the radio station building. She was popular among the students too. How did you miss her? And yet all those months you never once realized her true identity? Something's off about that. We had likely used some form of curse to keep us from finding out. Witches are capable of interfering with the laws of causality and the cognitive abilities of others. Probably made it so that no information regarding her or her whereabouts would ever reach us. That sounds so frightening. <laughs> Tell me about it. Makes sense though. She wouldn't be the only anguish to know how to mess with people's cognitive abilities. Weissman the Faceless. Alright. That's all I need to know for now. We're the Weissman. Anyway, have you caught your breath at least? Yes, thank you. We can keep going. Good, let's get a Ymir. Uh. This point, the enemies are not going to give me much EXP. Even for Elise, I'm probably not going to get too much. I might get some from the rock type enemies. Whoa! <laughs> This have to be happening. They might just be warning shots. Try and stay calm. Are uh, we going to make it in time? Knowing uh, Al uh, knowing Duke Alberea, he's pr he's probably just killing everyone's sight. That guy uh, is pretty much a, a massive piece of shit. Uh. All right, here goes. Seriously. Oh, heavens! Your Highness, please hurry back inside the mansion and hide. Whatever may come to pass, we won't allow them to touch you. 
Papa Bud. There you are. Honestly, we probably should have had her hide out in the wilds instead. Ugh. Rather than in a town. Ugh. We are the Northern Jaegers, and we've entered a contract with the Kreutzen province. By the order of its lord, Duke Alborea, we are here to take you into protective custody, your highness. No! Auntie Lucia? Out of the way, woman. I ask you to leave this village at once. The Schwarzer family has historical connections with the Imperial family. Yeah, the Noble Lights doesn't care about the Imperial family. They are essentially good. This this whole thing is probably doubling as a coup as well. A coup d'état. So as long as I live, you will not lay a hand on Her Highness. <laughs> you got guts, if nothing else. But I'm not going to repeat myself again. Our orders are that the lives of all other than Princess Alphen are of no consequence. Am I making myself clear? Hm. Oh, please don't! Don't you dare lay a hand on them! <sighs> Who are you? Uncle Teo! Darling. He should be a skilled swordsman, so... Hopefully it's a work. I am the Baron of Ymir, Teo Schwarzer, and I will serve as your opponent. Begin. One down. <clears throat> Not all talk, I see. The art of swordsmanship has been passed down in the Schwarzer family for generations. I couldn't hope to compare to Master Kafai or Lord Osei, but I dedicate myself to honing my skills all the same. <laughs> Clearly you're not the type of noble who sits idly by and hires men to fight his battles for him. But I wonder how much use your sword will have if we try this. Huh? Uh, uh, Shit! Sorry, Mr. Baron. You cowards! Have you no shame? All that matters to we Jaegers is fulfilling our contract by any means necessary. Fail to cooperate, and you know what happens next. Huh? It sounded like a machine gun. There's... there's fire everywhere! Damn it. Looks like we're up against some pretty high-ranking Jaegers here. Your Highness! <gasps> oh no, is Tio still alive after that? Okay, looks like Reed's about to de go demon mode again. Can I play as him during this? Yes. Show them who's boss. Bracers aren't allowed to kill people, he's but he's no bracer. Rain! Rain, don't. No, these guys aren't deserve it. Seriously. Don't lose yourself to anger. That will only lead to a repeat of what happened eight years ago. Elise. <sighs> Still breathing. Your father's alive, Reen. Hang in there. I'll do first aid right away. Lady Schwarzer is just fine too. Looks like they only the knocked her out. But I don't uh. see any injuries. She's okay. Auntie Lucia, stay with us. Oh, 
Do we get to fight Duke Alborea at some point? Are you... Are you back to normal? Reen, speak to me! Are you alright? Sorry, Elise. I lost control of myself again. It's alright. It's alright. You came back to me in the end. And that's all that matters. Elise, I'm sorry. I really am. Auntie Lucia! Are you alright, Auntie Lucia? <sighs> Your Highness, you're unharmed. Yes, I'm fine. And it's all because of you and your family. I can't even begin to thank you enough. Your Highness, there's no need to cry. You have the face of an angel. Please don't spoil it with tears. Well, I'm glad she's in no mortal danger. Tova, what about father? I've given him some first aid, but he was injured pretty severely. We should get him to somewhere he can receive proper treatment as soon as possible. No. Dad. Honestly, some people have no patience. Vita, you... What do you want with us this time? Concerns about how things were over here, so I decided to come and have a look. Duke Alborea's really gone and done it this time. It's obvious that he really wants to get ahead of Duke Cayenne, but this isn't the most prudent way to do it. <sighs> Another. Uh, 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 oh, so there, there's some divisions within that alliance, huh? You act like he's not one of your allies. Now, now, there's no need to take your anger out on me. I can't undo what's already happened. But if it will help, I can at least clear up his mess for you. What? It's time to sleep, my children. Fall into a loving oblivion, cradled in your merciful mother's arms. No, is she gonna brainwash everyone? A lullaby? No. This is... <sighs> You will descend the mountain as you are. Without any of your weapons? And you will report to Duke Alborea that you found nothing out of the ordinary. Yes, Mother. We will. Vita is oh clearly my. the best mom ever. Not. Unbelievable. So this is what you witches are capable of, is it? It's the least I could do after all the trouble you've been through. How, why doesn't she just use it on, on the players themselves, the party themselves? That way, she could just get them out of the way and just uh, uh, take uh, take out Reen's uh, 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 Reen Valimar easily like that. Just hypnotize them to death or something. Duke Alborea is unlikely to doubt what they tell him, so this village shouldn't be targeted again for a while. Although, I'm guessing a gesture like this pales in comparison to what I would have to do to earn your forgiveness. Misty, are you? Don't be taken in by her sweet talk. She's probably just distracting you so she can uh, try. Uh, d uh, she, so she can just kidnap Alfin anyways. She do things like this out of kindness. She doesn't. Targets in sight. Yup. Whoa, she can teleport with her mech. What? Oh wait. Huh. That, that mech looks rather familiar, a palette swap, huh? Uh, was she there the whole time, maybe in stealth mode? And why'd she have to take Elise, Elise as well? Your Highness! Shit! Was she here the whole time? Yep, a, st a stealth mode, probably. 
<laughs> now that was silly of you, wasn't it? You should never take your eyes off the princess you're meant to be protecting. Yeah, uh, the, the the good guys in this series usually have issues of attention span. That's for sure. As far as knights go, I'm afraid you failed spectacularly in nearly every regard. <laughs> Please, let me go! Targets apprehended successfully. Targets identified as Objective 1 and Objective 2. Mission complete. Oh shoot, they're trying to use Elisa's leverage against Reen. Who are you? And what do you want? And why does that thing you're on look just like Eric Getlam? It really does. I take it you being with her means you're an enforcer or something? Uh, I don't comprehend your question. How do you know- how do you not know what an enforcer is? I thought everyone working with the Alliance would know about Ouroboros by now, right? Hmm. She's not with Ouroboros, actually. She's a behind-the-scenes helper of sorts who was donated to the Noble Alliance by an anonymous benefactor. Think of her as yet another ally of the Alliances, much like ourselves, Zephyr, and the Imperial Liberation Front. <coughs> Couldn't ask for a more terrifying lineup right there. If you like, you can think of me as the Wicked Witch, while she's the Black Rabbit guiding my steps with every adorable hug. Ugh, stop messing around! Lady Clotilde, please give the order to retreat. There is no need to remain here any longer. <laughs> yes, I suppose you're right. Let's be going. Reen! 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 Elise! Your Highness! Stop! Stop! That was so anticlimactic. I thought they'd at least have to make us go through a Our hopeless boss well fight before kidnapping way. them. Obstacles waiting for you, but struggle on and overcome them. I'm surprised they didn't do. She didn't immediately do something like force Reen to give up Valimar or something in exchange for Elise. And I'm sure that eventually you'll reach the stage where the Azure Chevalier awaits. Don't let me down, Reen Schwarzer. Then again, the way she's speaking hints that she actually wants us to get strong enough to fight Crow on more equal footing. Maybe she thinks that by kidnapping Elise. She can force Reen to improve faster because he it, it, because he's it, it, because he'll be even more stressed about having to end the war. I won't let it end this way. Hang in there, you two. I'm coming for you. I promise. Uh, maybe we have a full party. We could have had some of them try to stand guard. Cruising Province Airspace. Oh. There's the Pantagruel. And there's Rufus. Hmm. Has something wondrous caught your eye? Duke Cayenne. Well, if it isn't Duke Cayenne and the Azure Chevalier. Marvelous, isn't it, Rufus? Does it not bring you joy? to look down upon our land from such great heights. Especially when one considers our victory in the war that rages on it, all but in our grasp. I'm afraid I have far too much on my mind at the moment to take in such pleasures. But the war is indeed raging on, just as you say. And with every day that passes, 
I worry more for the people of my father's province caught up in it. <laughs> so young, and yet you've already adopted such a delightful perspective. It's clear to me now why your father holds you in such high esteem. Had I a son like you, then I too would take notice of the achievements you've carried in the war thus far. <laughs> you flatter me, sir. Green though I may be, I intend to do all in my power to uh, carry green. out your will as Supreme Commander of the Noble Alliance. Uh, visual pun there, since he's wearing all green. <laughs> Please! I am Supreme Commander, yes, but I wouldn't permit merely anyone to take the position of Chief of Staff. Rest assured, you have earned my favor. We are both equally burdened to guide this conflict to a swift conclusion, all for the good of the common people who suffer from it. If only they understood the lengths we go to for Yeah, them. you don't give a shit about the people. At all. You're the ones who started the war in the first place. And on that note, I assume you've already decided on how we will be proceeding? At present, 60% of the nation is under our control. But on the other hand, the Imperial Army still has a full 50% of its military might remaining. The key to our victory lies in deciding how best to divide the remaining armored divisions between the East and West. <laughs> Excellent. Our Alliance forces have you, as well as the Panzer Soldats. We have General Aurelia and Brigadier General Wallace, two of the finest soldiers the Provincial Armies have ever seen. To say nothing of the Azure Diva and the countless other allies lending us their aid. Our victory is only a matter of time. Wouldn't you agree, Crow? <laughs> I wouldn't get too comfortable if I were you. Just so we're on the same page here, Divine Knights aren't omnipotent or anything. Ordeen isn't going to be wiping fortresses like Gorelia off the map in an instant the way Crossbell's Ion did. Crossbell? So that's the t weapon, Ion. They're not that mind-bogglingly powerful, sorry to say. So there's stuff out there that's way stronger than Divine Knights. Ugh. <laughs> Come now, Crow. You're so modest. Well, no matter. We needn't concern ourselves with Crossbell for the present. Gilead Osborn has fallen. No longer will we be plagued by that detestable man and his foolish ideals. <sighs> However, his loathsome legacy still lives on. And this great nation has been filled with undesirable pollutants as a result of him and his followers. Uh, the last game really tried to set up a scenario where both the reformists and the Old Noble Alliance were considered to be going about things the wrong way, but here they're really making the Noble Alliance uh, uh, look a lot worse. Possibly even worse than Osborne, since Osborne at least didn't try to start a a civil war over uh, 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 over anything. Our primary task shall be to wash away the filth and restore Erebonia to its rightful, glorious form, a land ruled by nobles. As you wish. <sighs> ah, I nearly forgot. Regarding the other Chevalier, I'm in the midst of pondering if there is a way to get him to join us. And being that you're such a close friend of his, your assistance may be required at some point. Give it some thought, won't you? Understood. You don't think it'll be quite as easy as our friend the Duke does, do you? I can see it written all over your face. Afraid not. The army isn't the only thing we need to worry about. Not with the RMP and the intelligence division at large. Then there's the fact we couldn't catch the Crimson Wings. Whatever other potential threats piling up on the side. Plus, you know, your brother's out there too. It's way too early to be getting cocky. Uh, ser seriously though, is it really the best time to have a civil war if uh, Crosswell's also got a giant eye on? I guess maybe Cross uh, 
I guess maybe Crossbell won't attack us as long as we don't attack them for now. So they figure they can just build, uh, they can just bide their time trying to make the uh, trying to get better technology to eventually counter Crossbell's ion. <laughs> My brother maybe is that's no the noble lights is plan. I'm expecting him to show me the best he can muster, and I don't doubt he'll come at me with everything he's got. But ultimately. Unforeseen circumstances are exactly the reason we carry only the finest insurance. Are they not, dear ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> You're so right. <laughs> Feels kind of overkill having all of us on the same side. Still, this is how wars are fought. Eh, whatever. So long as we get to have our fun. Yeah, that's way more than Estelle and Joshua had to deal with. They, I, they only had to... Deal with four enforcers, uh, with five enforcers plus vicemen. Just don't forget, we're not here for you. We won't be working together forever. At least she's surprisingly honest about how Ouroboros is towards their allies. <laughs> oh, but the fireworks that will spark from our partnership will be ever so beautiful. <sighs> yeah, I guess I can help. Point taken. I can't see anyone or anything out there having a chance against this group of monsters. <laughs> That's the idea. I leave the unseen side of this War of the Lions reenactment in your capable hands. War of the Lions reenactment? You're up against the Iron Bloods, the Crimson Wings, and the Horned Lions. With opponents like that, you needn't hold anything back. Go forth and enjoy your fill of battle. Uh, that's the end of the prologue. Alright, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe.